Okay, so Titus made it home last night and his clothes are still in the hallway. Viv has had fever the last three days. Sore throat. Sore throat, fever. But she lost her fever. Yeah, no more fever this morning. Yeah, I bet you won't come back though. No, it shouldn't. So you're gonna test today, right? Mm -hmm. She's gonna test, we're finishing up school this week. Violet is going through her school. This plant my sister Tara gave me and it's called kitten ears because it literally feels like a little kitten's ears. It's adorable. So I'm hoping that, I'm not sure on the sun and stuff, if it's full sun or, you know, partial sun. So I'm just keeping an eye on it. So it gets sun, but not like all day long. So I'm just gonna keep an eye on this. And this plant is from my pastor when I was little. This plant is from his mom, which was Sister Jessie. And my sister got a sprig from our, our friend um, Janet. And then Tara broke off a sprig and gave it to me. So this plant is from years and years ago. So I think that's super cool. And kind of a little bit of history <laughs> in the plant too. So, yep, this is called kitten ears. Girls it. are going with Titus to go get tacos. And Viv Violet's down with school, but Vivian is not. It's about 11.30 and I am leaving the girls with Titus. He's actually going to get tacos. And I am going to the gym. But I think I'm gonna go with the strength first because I seem to do it better at the gym. And then my our Titus is taking, keeping the girls and then he's working out. And if I'm not home, he's just gonna take them to my mom, so. Violet's done with school. She has to read to me and then Vivian is finishing up a test and we're done for the day. And we're trying to wind up school this week, so hopefully that happens. I got here and I forgot my earpods, so I'm going to head home and grab them. I found a gray hair in my hair this morning, so right there. I don't know if you can see it. That was really fun. <laughs> mm, and Titus does not want me to dye my hair. He thinks it's absolutely ridiculous that, I think there's Tamara. He thinks it's absolutely ridiculous that a girl would, a 40 year old woman would dye her hair because I'm 40 and I should look 40, huh? Which makes me feel really nice that he wants me to just look natural. And I probably, I don't know, I'm not, I told him, I'm not gonna say I'm not gonna dye my hair until I cross that bridge. Like, cause I don't wanna say I'm not gonna do it and then I do it. So I don't know, but yeah, right? Mm, where is it? It's right there. And that's where I've been trying to get them. It's like right there. And I pull them out and then they stay gone for a couple months. And then they come back. But so far I haven't had too many gray hairs. Nothing to worry about. Ooh. Okay, I just finished up about four-ish, almost five miles. And then I did some planking with 10 pounds on my back. And then, um, Olivia is coming over today and now Cheyenne and then my, my sister-in-law called and the Goodwill is open in Turlock so we're going to actually change our plans today and I'm going to drop my girls off at my mom's just for the fact that Vivian has had fever and I don't want to take her out so she's not going to be too happy about that but I don't want to just like relapse her so um, we're going to go I'm gonna drop, go home and get ready, drop the girls off at my mom's, and then we are gonna go to Turlock to the Goodwill, and I'm really excited because I'm wanting white plain dishes for my hutch, and um, I'm hoping to find those. So anyways, a little bit red, I sweated really good, which I really like to sweat. I feel cleansed after I sweat. Oh no, 
never seen that guy in our neighborhood before. It's a guy walking in the neighborhood and I usually know pretty much everyone that walks. Glad I got my workout in, it's 12.30 and I'm gonna shower really quick and then everyone else is gonna look super cute and I'm just gonna be super plain. <laughs> Ah, I'm such a plain person. Oh, no. There's my sisters doing landscaping in Carrie's yard. She's going to be adding a lamppost right there with the wheelbarrow. Here, here's your Mother's Day gift. Happy Mother's Day. Isn't it cute? Oh, wow. It's just something simple. It doesn't really smell really strong, though. Hi, Ann. Hi. No, it's like it's not very strong. That's fine with me. Okay. Well, they're going to Nana, so. Okay. okay, we're headed to the Goodwills. There's Oli. Sorry, it's shaky. Cheyenne. And then Trent. So we're just going to go to the Goodwill in Turlock and then maybe Lowe's and we're going to go to Starbucks. So yeah, it's going to be fun and just hopefully just a relaxing two hours. I'm getting what Tren always gets. What is this, Tren? Ice caramel latte. An ice caramel latte, and it's my first time trying it. And I really, really like it. Like, I like it better than the frappes. Out uh, here? Uh, yes, I like it better than the frappe. I didn't know that, and now I do. So I really, really like it, and I bought Tren's. <laughs> Tren bought me a little gift the other day. I, I have... told her not to do it. I was having like a really low day, like, with, yeah, with Titus's job change, I guess, like, I have these moments where I'm okay with it, and then I have these moments where I'm like, not okay with what it. What is that? So she brought me a little gift to brighten up my day. Oh, that's what you wanted to get. To tango lemonade. What'd you get, Wait, Cheyenne? No. Iced um, green tea matcha with what's vanilla. The, what's the like red caramel. stuff in it's it? Caramel. I put caramel in it. Oh, I don't like that drink. It tastes like grass. I can't do it. <laughs> I think it tastes What'd you get, Oli? How would you do uh, it? I don't know if I ordered it. It's something tango lemonade. Something. That's what you wanted to get. A tea. It's a passion fruit tea. Trent wanted lemonade. to get a tea, and I threw her off her groove, and she forgot. Hang out a lot of day. I, I wanted to get that blackened lemonade oh, yeah. tea, or, but it's okay. All right. I'll just be up all night. <laughs> she said uh, three. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> All right. You can have a what to? Uh, yeah, <laughs> off to Turla, or off to the Goodwills. Okay, I got ten dollars worth of stuff. Look how nice the shoe holder is. Whoops, four dollars, and it's isn't it brand new? Up close, it looks like you, new. You can't tell, but it's like perfect. And I was just thinking, I need this for Titus's shoes. And then I got silverware, and I got the girls two pairs of nice shoes for like a dollar. And then I bought Cheyenne a candlestick. <laughs> <laughs> okay, where do we go, Oli? Oh, I just love the sandwiches. Here's the first. Yeah, we went to Ike's, and then in and out. Well, then you know, you had to order like at the door, and they had to bring yeah, it to you. To like call them. And we didn't know what they had, so we didn't want to eat there because we've never been inside. Yeah. And then we went to in and out. And the line was all like literally crazy. How many cards? Like twenty? I'd say oh, like 20. I was gonna, yeah, I was gonna say like twenty, maybe even thirty. So then we came to Deli Delicious, and they're open. So now we're ordering. There's Trent and Cheyenne ordering. And the guy is very slow at the register. He's new. When you asked him, he was like, uh, yeah, he went down. Uh-huh. So now we're just getting it something to eat here at Deli Delicious. Well, we just got back from Turlock, right? Yep. And we're going to pick up the girls because they're at her mom's house. So we're headed there right now, and then we're going to come home, clean up the house, and oh. make dinner. We have doors being measured for tomorrow. 
So we have to have every room in the house picked up because he has to go in every room in the house and measure for doors. And the house is, it's messy, huh? It's not bad though. I'm home and I'm, we're gonna pick up the house, but I got my Bath and Body Works candles in. And my sister-in-law, Trin, has this scent and I love it. So when the candles went on sale, I um, ordered four of this scent. And then I ordered two previously. And then I ordered, that's odd. I thought I ordered more than that. What is this? Yeah. I ordered a lemon zest too and they didn't send it. Maybe they were out. That's odd. I know I ordered two blueberries and lemon zest. And I think it's lemon zest. Anyways, I'll have to go through my email. Maybe it wasn't available. The blueberry pie smells so good. It has good. like a false smell, a false scent, and it makes my whole house smell like. Can I open up the other one? No, I'm, I'm gonna put it away. So like, like I'm baking, uh, blue, like I'm baking blueberry muffins oh, or something. It so. Blueberry pie. Yes. Oh. Vivian likes it too. I love it. So we got two more of these, and I thought I got a lemon zest, but I guess I didn't. super nice he's given me dirt which is super hard to come by in town and then mulch so for free okay we're taking this fiddle leaf tree because he's in a smaller vase and we're gonna put it in this big giant one that we got at Costco so that way he can grow tall and he's not really gonna grow and I've already got new leaves on him too. So then maybe I'll tell you how to keep my fiddle leaf tree alive. Um, but yeah, let's get started. You guys, look at this. This is a new leaf off my fiddle leaf tree. Isn't that crazy? I'm super excited. <gasps> I love it. Violet has those big gloves on. Da, da. So we're gonna be a dusty mess and all sweaty. I'm already dusty and sweaty. Yeah, me too. <laughs> we gotta get him out, and hopefully, we're gonna water him and get this out. I'm gonna hurt my hair. I think I'll yeah. my rings. Then can yeah. you go turn the water well, Turn the water on just a little bit. Okay, poop. Oh, I feel it was giving away. Is it? Yep, look at my hands going all the way down. So, should we. Oh, Violet, take this. We'll take this plant out. I'm transplanting this right here. Yeah. He's like a pretty succulent. You ruined my so put that dirt in here. So notice this. I don't even know if I'm doing this right. Violet, no, no, no. You're not going to bring dirt over my outfit. Sorry. It's put just, some more water in. It's an ugly outfit. Don't take the uh, actual root. Yeah. That me and Oli did, babe. I feel like I'm like doing a C-section or something. <laughs> <laughs> Do you feel it in there like giving away? Get yeah. some more water in here, Violet. If you get Okay, gently, water. gently. Violet does everything 110%. Put the water over me. there on the grass. <laughs> we're putting a plant in a I feel like we're trying to rescue some water. animal or something, huh? <laughs> oh, there he comes. I feel like we just delivered a baby. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay let's put him in here. I get the child. We're going to open him up again on the bottom. Oh, oh I just me. smashed his little leaves. <laughs> Hopefully it does. Well, it has like, four legs. Well, I had to turn it over. Yeah. Okay, we got him in, so now we're gonna. Oh, sorry, Olivia. That's fine. Okay, hold him up straight. You know, like, yeah, there you go. Now I'll put the dirt in. Yeah. Did Anybody... you not just run to the store? Guys, I have a dirty dog. I know, it's so funny. Oh my goodness. But he's, I love fiddle leaf trees. Anybody who likes getting dirty, give it a thumbs up. If anybody likes to get dirty, give a thumbs up. Or if you don't like to get dirty, yeah. Oh, this is pretty, huh, Oli? If you don't like to get dirty, give it a thumbs up, too. Both like give it a thumbs up. So both give it a thumbs up. Give it a thumbs up if you like getting dirty. And if you don't like getting dirty. I know. And there's a lot of dirt.
always doing a good job of dusting the plants. I do spray thieves because my sister-in-law told me about that, uh, Darian, and I do thieves and okay, citrus, citrus fresh inside. Yeah, my mom's couch is wet. And um, I think it helped. I think it helps it. So, like I Look, said, can you put some in here? Yeah, we're gonna start putting him. That's what that's He's gonna show you Don't guys. He's new. He's I new. Just the this little guy, it. these ones up and here are new. Rose, Rose pulled three leaves off my tree, so it'd even be fuller. Yes, she pulled three leaves off my fiddle leaf tree. What a brat. But I've kept this alive for a solid year. Okay, so we planted him, and I'm hoping he will take to this pot and grow and do what's plant food or something. It's in a green bottle. I just used the rest of it up. I'll add to this. I'll Miracle add thieves. Worker. Mom, Something like that. I'll add thieves and citrus, citrus fresh from my young living to my fiddle leaf tree. Mom, I'm growing and, <laughs> and um it just I don't know, I think it does help. So I just come out here and just spray it on like I this. have grown warts. Okay. Black warts. Anyways, yeah. So he only gets sun in the morning time and and mainly just on the base of the tree. And then uh, when it's really hot in the summer, I, I sometimes scoot them into the patio. That way they're just completely out of the sun altogether. So yeah, morning sun and mainly on the base and I've kept them alive for a year and I, I really am shocked. So this is gonna be my second summer doing flowers and I've did a really good job keeping them alive. So I'm just a simple mom who knew nothing. So if I can do it, you can do it too. And maybe you'll find that you love flowers and planting as much as I found out that I love it. Like I absolutely love it. It's relaxing. And it almost feels like um, relaxing like when I run. I feel relaxed when I run. Um, I almost get the same, what's it called? High from planting flowers like I do when I'm running. So yeah, give it a try and oh, okay. see if you like it. Cause I've produced seven new leaves on this tree right here alone. And if the new leaves come in, they're very soft, like almost plasticky feeling. And these, like here, they're like more harder and crisper. I don't know. It's like the newer the leaf, the softer they are. And then they kind of get hard and crispy in a way. Crispy but anyways, like yeah. Toast. All right. Like my mom if you like this toast. video, give it a thumbs up. If you like getting dirty, give it a thumbs up. Yeah. Hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. And I really hope you guys enjoy the videos. And I hope you guys come back for more. And we're still not done. <laughs> All right. Let's get this other little thing planted. And that's where my three leaves were that rose pulled off. Do you see the little arch that's bare? That's where my dear niece rose. Do you care if this gets wet? No. Olivia is gonna get the tea ready and I'm gonna start dinner. We're gonna make um, pork and bean burritos, which is super, which is super easy. And I'm just, today I'm only adding sour cream and cheese to it. That's it. I, I usually, Add like tomato and onion, but I'm not, I'm, tonight I'm tired. And if a Mexican restaurant was open, I'd go eat at it, but it's not, so. I have to cook once more. And I drain the juice um, before I add it to the cooked meat. I add just a touch of sugar. And then I add garlic salt. A little bit of taco seasoning. A lot of taco seasoning. Yeah, I added a little too much taco seasoning. <laughs> and then I add a little bit of onion, uh, granulated onion. Did you get a sore in your foot, Rocky? Oh, Rocky, he's got a two years old. A tender foot. Which yeah. is like, he's 14 right now. Oh, uh, wait, he's still limping. No, he's not. He's probably just tender right now. Oh. Oh, 